Good evening, Al. We begin with the coronavirus. The city of Columbia has repealed their emergency mask mandate as COVID cases continue to fall. This comes as Forest Acres also lifts their order, but Richland County votes to keep theirs in place. News 19's Eleanor Tabone sat down with health experts now to get their take on the ease and restrictions. Ordinance 2021-81 are hereby repealed. This ordinance shall take effect immediately. Columbia City Council voted unanimously to end the city's mask order. Cease the enforcement of the mask ordinance. Masks are important because they not only protect um, you as an individual, but it does also afford those who you're around. According to DHEC, on August 25th, there were more than 6,000 new COVID-19 cases across the state. On November 7th, that number dropped to just over 300 new cases. The lifting of mask mandates at a local level um, isn't going to impact us as much um, given that this is limited to local jurisdictions. Assistant Professor of Epidemiology at USC Dr. Mufaro Karangarara says vaccinations are helping reduce numbers. Um, I think we're in a pretty good position. Um, we've got high vaccine coverage. We've opened up vaccines for kids. But as you know, things can happen. The minute we get comfortable and withdraw uh, the use mask, uh, then we have a surge. While Dr. Nadine Brooks, Chief of Nursing at Columbia College, believes it's too early for mask mandates to be lifted. It'll be very important for us to continue to wear masks. And as a nurse um, and um, as someone that has witnessed the pattern um, that we've established, I think we are going to see a, a rise in cases. Both experts believe we will see a spike in cases during the holidays. I definitely do think that we will see a spike, but I don't think it's going to be at the level or magnitude that we did see, let's say, last year. My concern is that we're going to see an uptick in numbers again, and this time uh, the variant is going to be different. In Columbia, Eleanor Tabone, News 19, WLTX. And depending on the number of cases down the road, Columbia and Forest Acres leaders could vote to require the face mask coverings again at a later date.